but did it feel like maybe you guys kind of got put back on your heels a little bit there early in the game and just couldn't quite find your feet again? Yeah, collectively? yeah, I would say so. I think um, you know they knocked us. They did a good job of knocking us out of our rhythm early, and um, you know we came out with a lot of confidence. I think, especially in pregame and this whole week, we had a good week of prep, but. Um, they came out and punched us in the mouth, and, and I do think it caught us off guard and it knocked us out of our rhythm a little bit. Yeah. The word we've heard a lot so far is disappointed. Just describe, you know, what you guys are feeling and how you move on from it. Yeah, it is. It's frustrating. Um, you know, you prepare all week. You have a really good week of prep, and um, <clears throat> to go out and, and just play like play the way we did is, is definitely disappointing. But um, it's a new week. Uh, this season's still so early, so young. We have so many more opportunities. Um, so it's just about coming back in on Monday and um, getting back in our groove and, um, you know, leaders got to lead and uh, continue pushing forward. You said you had a good week of prep, but then Ohio State punched you guys in the mouth. So what was the differential between practice and what happened in the game to start out? Yeah, I mean, they just did a really good job. We didn't execute early. I think that was probably the biggest thing. Um, you know, two, two, three and outs in the first two drive, I think that hurt us. Um, and they just did a really good job, credit to them, obviously. Um, but from our standpoint, we, we just have to be better in our execution. Um, and I think that's kind of what threw us off. Coach Allen felt like. Those first two drives, you did uh, take some deep ball shots early and so just missed them again by a uh, stride here and there. Is it, uh, was that part of the game plan to, to, to just keep attacking no matter what? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, we wanted to take our shots when, when that opportunity presented itself. And uh, sure, got to hit them. Um, you know, that's part of it, and just you know, try to keep pushing forward. And we did our best to continue taking our shots when, uh, when that opportunity presented itself. Did you feel like you had enough time in the pocket, Coach Allen? Kind of alluded to that. It was hard. To... Yeah, I mean, anytime you play play in Ohio State, um, they're going to have guys. You, your time is going to is not going to be as long. Um, and that's you go, as a quarterback, you go into this game knowing that. Um, uh, they're really good, but I had, I mean, there were there were definitely some dropbacks where I had enough time to deliver the ball, and um, they kept me upright. Um, you know, they're going to get pe penetration, they're going to get pressure. That's that's part of it. Um, but I would say overall, you know, they, they the line did a good job keeping me protected. What's your assessment of where the running game's at right now and the struggles that they're having moving the ball? Yeah, I mean, obviously we got to be better, um, but uh, you know, it's it's just a matter of keep pushing forward. It's it's um, coming to the sideline. It's making adjustments. Um, maybe getting different looks that we didn't see. Um, so just kind of just adjusting and continuing to push forward in practice and making a point of emphasis, uh, continuing a as we go forward. You know, Coach Allen said it was going to be a game time decision. When did you kind of let you know that you were going to be going in there? Yeah, I mean, I always prepare. Like, I'm going to go out and be the guy, um, period. So, um, you know, I, I, pre I prepped all week like I was going to be the guy. And, um, you know, I just found out, um, you know, whenever he told me. So. Uh, that, that's kind of the end of the story there. All right, thanks, Peyton.